this is Panel95 from We Gaming Crew. Today I'm going to be doing another episode on Skyblock Water. So first I'm just going to go to my island. So in between episodes I have taken down on the Christmas things that was here and over there. And I have been collecting resources because I did visit people's islands and some people had gold farms so I collected some gold and this hero kit was given to me at spawn by a drop party a few people were given things there's some free storage room that I will visit in one minute and also in this video I have plans I'm hopefully going to be building a nether portal here as well and then maybe extend this island and start building my house so I'll list all these people's islands that I have visited to get these resources in the description and I'll show you them now. So this is the person's island where I got the gold from. Uh, this nice room here and basically uh, exactly the same room here which is their storage room. Then here is the farm I got all the gold from. So it's basically silver fish spawners have custom drops. You drop all gold ingots so I collect all these and you get quite a lot of gold really quickly and then I can sell this gold in the shop like this and for some reason it doesn't work so I do have to actually craft them into gold blocks when I get home so I'll show you in the next island so I am now at the first island where I got no food and ender pearls from so we have a nice like place up here and there's a casino up there somewhere then this way is an iron farm and a storage room but I got the food down here so this is where you can get all food and wool from and then there's the ender pearls through here so you can visit these islands so all their names will be linked down in the description so now I'll just go back to my island so all of the gold I did collect just now from that, the gold farm, I have crafted them into gold blocks. If I go to the shop, I'm just sell them all for 60,000 here. So in this episode, I am hopefully going to be building a nether portal here and maybe extending and maybe building a house over there. So first I'm going to just go to the shop, see if you can actually buy obsidian. Yes you can. So I think you I think you need ten. So I'll just buy ten. It's not really too expensive I hope. So I will hopefully put this in the middle, so I'm just going to work out where I put it and I'll be right back. So I've now worked out a frame where the nether portal will go, so I'm just going to place in all the obsidian. There we go, so now I need to check if I have any food and I don't have iron. I'm just going to buy some flint from the shop. So I've had to buy 10 gravel as there's no flint, so I'm going to place all this down see if I get food. And I don't get anything to so place down again. Don't get any that time place it here again. I've just successfully got a piece of flint, now I have my last gravel up and place it into this chest. So now I'll craft flint and steel. So now I'm just going to see if it works. And it does. Now it's entering the level for the first time. Um, 
So unfortunately I cannot do anything in a nether, which is a bit annoying, but I will still decorate it as I'll be nice and nice. So I'm just going to place some gold blocks around it as well, to run away this wood. I mean, if I refresh my island level, it should go um, a bit higher in placing these blocks. And first gold in here. So if I go to slash is and do island level, so if I write it and do block values, so the gold blocks do 150 points out of four. So if I just refresh this, if I left click and I'll just wait a few seconds. So now my island level is at 15 and I need 100 points in the next level. So now I am thinking so I can buy lottery tickets. I go slash lottery. So the next draw is in 8 minutes. This is the current money you win. So I can buy one. So if I do slash lottery, buy. So I have purchased one lottery ticket. So I could win that amount of money. So now I'm also thinking that I would like to put a fence around this. So that everything is linked up to that. So I'm going to do that now actually. And I'm just going to craft some of this. Craft some sticks. And just do this. I believe he has, does craft fences, so I have to place them all around here. So it is a bit annoying, the never portal didn't actually work for some reason, and I don't know why. So I'll ask you how to get to the never, but I don't, just don't think you can. Crafted fences. So. so I think you can have your island biome in a nether, but I think you have to make it so all this that you see here would just be never and not like there won't be any sky or anything. So I'll place that so now. I will probably just get to work and extend this and start building my house. now just finished the top layer of this platform and I'm just going to start building the first part of my house that will be here. So I've got some materials while I will be planning. It will be just a simple house for now and I am planting some birch trees here so you can grow. So I will leave a bit of a gap so I can walk around it but I'll leave like roughly this much here. And I will go up 
for now. Now we'll do it over here. I've now put all these four posts here on the moon I will just be filling it in with wood here then I'll put wood here so I think we are running out of time in this episode so now I'll just go and vote So I have five vote keys now, so I'm just going to vote, and these are all the prizes you can get. So now I'm just going to vote with these five vote keys. And we got $10,000 of our own cash. And we have got fifty thousand dollars going in cash. We vote again. We've also got now another chicken spawner. We we'll vote again. We have got ten thousand dollars going in cash. We we'll wait for the final time. We have got hundred thousand dollars ring in cash. So this is now the end of this video here. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.